do I overcome the fear of talking to people slash girls? Well, you didn't have to put people or girls. People is girls are people. But to answer your question, the best way to go on about talking to people is really by doing put just go do it. That's really the best way to go. Just go talk to them. You asking me a question on how to talk to people, just go do it. There's only so much I can tell you, and there's only so much you can get and learn from me. And YouTube videos and courses and all this. Just go do it. You'll learn that way. That's like the best. That's like the greatest way to learn. Let's go do it. Let's go talk to them. It's not that hard. Y'all niggas be so scared of like rejection or people not liking you or whatnot. I don't know what y'all be scared of. It ain't nothing really to be scared of. Just how is having a back? Like not everyone's going to say yes to you. Not And not everyone's going to say no to you. Some people going to say no. Some gonna say yes, some gonna mess with you, some not gonna mess with you. Some gonna be a vibe, some not gonna be your vibe. It's okay, bro. Start off like, let's put it this way. Let's start off like this. You probably in high school right now. So uh yo crush that's in school, just go up to her. Talk to her. Or any girl that you find like attractive or whatnot, just go up to them. It's really not that hard. Like a lot of us, I think my demographics like ages 13 to like 27 or 25 or something like that that's my demographic so between that age range maybe 13 they might be childish a little bit but a lot of us is probably like 16 17 a lot of people are they're not gonna be cooking your shit and they're not gonna cook you in your face the most they're gonna say is i have a boyfriend oh we're talking about growing up the most they're gonna say is i have a boyfriend or i'm not interested those are like the two things they're gonna say they're gonna go with number one i have a boyfriend you know what? That's okay. Not everyone's gonna be interested. Not everyone's gonna say yes. It's all right. I don't need to get out that. I don't know why you'd be so scared of like the word no. Like this generation just don't like the word no. They want everyone to be like say yes and like everybody decided with them and all this. Not even gonna do that, bro. Am I an introvert or extrovert? Uh, I think I'm an introvert. No, no, no. I know I'm an introvert. Well. I can be extroverted, like, when it comes to... That's not extroverted, though. I just... If you like my close homeboys, I can be outgoing with you, so... I'm more of an introvert. If I'm in a room full of people... I don't know. How do I word this? I don't even know how to put that, because when I'm in a room full of people, like, they tend to always still, like, want to talk to me. Like, I guess that the energy I carry around? I don't know. Or how when I'm... I don't really... I'm not really always talkative all the time. Like, I just be chilling. I ain't no shy nigga though, but I'm just more like, I don't know how to word it. But yeah, I'm getting off topic. But to answer your question, just go out and talk to people. I don't know why you'd be so, I don't know why you'd be so scared. Just go, go talk to them. Just go talk. And I don't know how to put my chat on the screen though. I gotta learn how to do that. So when I upload YouTube videos, I can put that stuff right there. But yeah. It's like, okay, let me give you an example. Because I struggle with that too talking to people or not talking to people i struggled with walking to i didn't struggle with it but i wasn't good at approaching women put it that way because when i was in high school and i had crushes or when people people normally liked me and i i i was the type in high school where like if you liked me then i guess i like you too but if you i'm not, I'm not really gonna approach nobody or none of that like that i didn't really my head wasn't focused on that because I've been doing content creation since freaking seventh grade. So I was always coming home, playing video games, and streaming, and uploading YouTube videos of me playing the game and streaming the game. So I was always just, my mom was always revolved around that. So anything else in life, I didn't really care about. But if a girl liked me, I guess I like you too. But when I got to college, I had to get up out that mindset. So what I really, what I did was on Saturdays, there was a, the campus bus took us, took the students who wanted to like go to the like malls or go out places, it would take them take us certain places. So I said I would go to the mall and I would purposely approach a group of women, like a group of it had to be like three, two, two, to like five people. It had to be like a group of group of people, and I would uh pick out one I liked and I'll approach them and I'll greet everybody else saying hi, what's up, my name's Trey, uh, I find you what's my god, such and such and such, and that's really how I got I got got good at talking. <laughs> To women, people, I just got good at it. Or like when I was younger, like my dad, for example, because 
I got good at, I don't know how to put this. I got good at talking to people, but when it came to girls, I wasn't good at approaching them because I never did the approaching because I never cared about it. That makes sense. I know y'all get it. Now y'all understand. But back to high school, my dad, he would, like, once I got to, like, 15, 16, my dad would make me, like, let's say when I had to open up a bank account, made me do that myself. I had to talk to the bank teller and all this, do that myself. Or a doctor's appointment to have me go in there by myself and talk to the doctor and all this. He stopped going in there with me. So that's how I got better with talking to people in general. But when it came to approaching girls I liked or had an interest in, I wasn't really good at that because I never really cared. I'm like, oh, she attractive. But I didn't give a fuck because I was so focused on other stuff. And that's how I am now. But that's to answer your question. The, the best way to get good at Talking to people is going to go out and do it. If you want to get good at talking to girls and getting a lot of girls, you got to go talk to the girls. You can't just, you can't just watch a YouTube video, watch six, seven YouTube videos, 15 minutes long on how to pull girls and, mm, and then not implement it. Because a lot of y'all niggas just watch the videos and don't do none of the work. Y'all don't implement nothing. Y'all go to the gym huh, 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 and think that's just, think that's enough. Nah, you gotta, it starts up here, bro. Or anything else, you gotta have the mindset, bro, to go do that. But yeah.